My name's Melinda and recently I had to make the decision to possibly get a pick line in my arm. So I went ahead and did it. Um, here it is, not that bad. A lot of people have to get them now, I guess. Um, it's like with the new infectious disease control, they said it's saving money if you are able to do your medications at home. Well, it's been kind of a weird ride and just kind of stick with it, but um, overall, it's not that bad. I was really scared. Um, and really nervous because I've been through so many things. I just had hip surgery. Um, it, it went bad. I'm still having problems with it, but that's here and there. Anyways, um, pick line's so easy. It really is. They obviously do it, but here's the netting that goes over. Super easy. Um, goes in right there. These tape, I know it looks gross, but that's just the glue. Um, so, I don't know if you've ever had an ID or anything before, but really easy goes in there it's like a sticky stays clean stays dry don't get it wet of course so that's part of what I'm going to show you today is how to wrap it easy that's why I look like this because I'm getting ready to get in the shower in a few minutes so I wanted to just do like a little quick tutorial and I'm already talking too much but anyway it's super easy you're going to clean all this with alcohol it's not going to be that big a deal and you also probably will not have this guy right here, yeah, exactly, wanting to figure out what's going on. So, anyways, I'm going to cover this back up um, really quickly. They also have, when you get all your stuff from your medical supply place, they're going to give you these little stretchy armband things. Um, make sure you get extra because a lot of times... I like to change mine every two days. Like right now, it's already driving me nuts. I feel like it's already kind of, what do you want, dirty enough or whatever. Just from every day, your clothes, you know, will fuzz will get on it, that kind of thing. See, like there's a little fuzz. But after I get out of the shower, new one goes on. But I, le I do leave it on for me. I do leave it on while I'm in the shower. Makes it easier. So um, super easy. Going to show you real quick how to wrap it. It's how I do it. It's not rocket science, but it's also not going to be perfect, but it's going to do the job when you go in the shower. So excuse how I look. Hair, crazy, I know. So, super easy. Out of the drawer, saran wrap, freezer tape. I love the freezer tape because obviously you can go in the freezer for a reason. Um, now, I personally am not going to use this for my food. I'm going to buy another one. Well, I do have another one, but it's in the cabinet. Um, this is only for my arm. It's just saran wrap. Super easy. Glad, la gra glad wrap. I can never say anything right. Anyways, I just kind of unroll it. Like that. Hold it with one arm. Got it? Stick it underneath. I mean, how hard is saran wrap? Super easy. Now, the hardest part, just hold it down. Go over it. And it's going to be way loose in the very beginning. But that's your first wrap. So easy. I know it looks more complicated than it is. Once you, once you get it to stick to itself, maybe unroll a little bit more. Once it sticks to itself, it goes quicker. And you'll be able to do it better. But you gotta get it all the way up. I guess I need to move my shirt out of the way a little bit more. See? Get it all the way up over your arm. Unroll it as you go. And again, roll down a few pieces at a time. Use your other hand. This is if you have to do this, of course, all on your own. Like I said before, it's not perfect. And of course, this time, it's so not perfect, and because I'm trying to show you at the same time as I, I do it. There we go. That's a little better. And roll it again. Okay, now, now it's finally starting to get tight. You'll be able to do it easier once you start working on it yourself. Um, but a lot of time, when I take a shower, nobody's here. So, here we go. Otherwise, I'd have somebody else help me. Now, you're going to have to go over your arm. Now, the hard part about going over your arm is your arm bends. So, just take it, go like that, flip it over so it, you can kind of see it. So, it goes in like that. And then just go over again. That way, you're, where your crease is. So, you've gone around a few times. You can see it's kind of tight right here. That's what you want so the water doesn't get down there. Um, I still kind of, when I take a shower, I keep my arm out of the way. Here's another one. Ready? I twist it again. And all that does is it wraps it, 
but right when it gets to your arm, it helps it to it bends. So do it again. And as you're doing it, you're layering it over too. So there you go. So you're still gonna be, you're gonna be completely covered. It's gonna be fine. If you don't think so, put an extra wrap on there. It's not a big deal. It's what, five bucks for another thing of this, if that. So here we go, do it again. See, look at that. Not only that, you can actually bend your arm. The first time I did it, I looked like a crazy robot. You're still gonna have a weird robot arm. It's not gonna be the easiest, so. I mean, just don't get frustrated. I did a few times when I first started doing it. But then there you go. And then just wrap down the bottom because anybody knows when you take a shower, the water's gonna go down your arm. Um, and if you're like me, you've probably fast forwarded through all of this already, and that is more than fine. I'm just kind of showing you an over thing. Okay, so there you go. Technically, it would have been easier if I would have just, uh, I mean, it sticks to itself, but I was going to say you can pull off some pieces of tape. But here you go. Then just put that last piece over. And I mean, it's really not that drastic. So um, I think a lot of people just get worried. I know in the beginning I was like really nervous about it. Um, not only just pain wise, but I don't want to get an infection, so I'm terrified with it getting dirty and all that kind of stuff. That's why. Um, like I said, uh, I do, do the, that little piece of cotton on there. Um, just makes me feel better. But look, that was easy. So use your freezer tape to pull off little pieces. It looks like a hot mess. I look like a crazy mummy robot, whatever you want to call it. You can barely bend your arm, but guess what? Just by doing this little tiny bit, you can bend your arms to shave your legs or your other armpit. Plus, it gives you space so you can still shave. I know, TMI, I get it. But believe me, when you're in the shower and you can only have your arm out like this because somebody helped you wrap it straight and then you're going like this and you can't bend to do anything with your hair, I'm right-handed, so, I mean, how much can you really do with your other hand? Anyways, again, TMI, I know. But I was going to show you one thing real quick. When you do get your bandage, your, your pack from your, who, your medical supply place or whatever, this is the cotton that they send you. This is actually that thing that was on my arm. I thought, oh, I can save it and I can do half and half. Just order some extras. I mean, seriously, this stretches out. So as you do it, see, it stretches out. Now, the first, I would say two and three days at the most, I would, I don't like to go more than that. I think it's gross, but whatever. Um, it makes it nice and tight so you can actually move your arm. And it doesn't roll down. By your third day, it's really starting to roll down from the top, and it's just annoying. You put your sweater on, you put your shirts on, you put, you know, whatever. But, yeah, it looks longer than it is. It's actually not, so when you do get it on your arm, um, it stretches out. So, I know you probably don't think, you're like, oh, it's going to stretch. It doesn't. It actually, don't cut it in half. It's a waste. So, anyways, that's it. If you have any questions or anything, um, you can... Posted on here. This is actually my first video, so I don't even know what to do. So I'm sure you'll be able to figure it out. Awesome. Good luck. Um, pick line, totally the way to go. So much easier than having to go to the hospital every single day or to the doctor's office or wherever. But good luck. Go take a shower. See you later.